Well, gee golly willikers, Batman. Watch out for that curb. Yeah, I'm stuck on a curb again. All right, curb, bring it on. Bring it on, curb. Bring it. Really? <laughs> Hello, everybody. I'm Kindly Keen, and welcome back to Brick Rigs. This episode, we're finally going to be showing off some of these awesome, awesome Steam Workshop creations. Um, I picked some of the, the, the ones that I thought were the coolest, um, and hopefully you guys enjoy them as well. So let's uh, jump into the showcase of awesome Lego buildings. Alright, so uh, this is one of the first ones that I downloaded. It's this low floor European bus, and man, is it impressive. Um, there's a lot of parts, there's a lot of things going on here. And actually, I think I want to move to a different location so that we can see these things get blown up into billions of pieces. But let's, uh, let's just spawn it. There we go. Look at this thing. It is massive. It is enormous. I want to see where... I want to go to the blenders. We need to go to the blenders. Blenders... I just crashed into a wall because I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Alright, let's get this thing. This thing is not going to be great at, uh, four-point turns. New, no, new. No. Not designed for that kind of action. Wow, this thing is really moving. Uh, did we just lose a piece? I think we just lost a piece. Hopefully it wasn't important. Alright, the blenders are over here. Sweet. I found the blenders. Oh, you're going in, buddy. You are going into the blenders. Ah, the promised land. Let's go, European lowrider whatever bus. Jump it! Holy cow! You cleared the blenders. This guy does not want to go quietly into that good night, sir. No, he does not. We're good. We lost our entire cab, but but we can still do some destruction. So let's let's go a little bit slower this time. Take our time. Ah, there we go. Yes. This is the way it's done. I can't see anything. What what is going on? Wow. The bus got pulverized so quickly. We didn't even get to see it happen. All right, one more time for the Euro bus. Beep beep beep. There was a fence there. Let's ignore that. All right, don't go so stinking fast. Let's, we don't want to clear the, the, the blenders. We want to go right into them. Here we go. Let the magic happen. This is by far one of the most amazing features in a video game. The ability to turn on slow motion on the fly and watch things just explode. It's, it's magical. It's so good. This is mesmerizing. This is mesmerizing. <laughs> there it goes. Well... That was absolutely awesome. So let's check out another creation. Before we move on to the next creation, I do want to give credit where credit is due. This creation was created by a user called Volvo. Good, good safe cars. The, them Volvos. But uh, yeah, he made this and it's, uh, it's awesome. Well done. Now this was a creation that I could not pass up. This, this was too amazing. And I believe that this one was actually created by the developer. I, I could be mistaken, um, but it's it's awesome. I haven't actually used it, but I do. My understanding is you can't actually shoot, so let's spawn it and see what kind of destruction we can cause with this awesome, awesome tank. All right, can we shoot? Oh, look at that! Yes, this is amazing. This creation is unbelievable. Look at the detail, man. He did a really, really good job, man. So cool. Nope, don't tip over though. Don't tip over! <laughs> Must have not heard me. I said don't tip over. You tipped over. We can change the camera view. Oh, this is cool. We can be right up in the turret. Oh, that's awesome. I kid you not, guys. When I said that's awesome, my Xbox One just turned on. What, what kind of alternate dimension are we living in where the word that's awesome turns on an Xbox? I don't know. Anyways, moving on. Xbox, turn off. Yes. Let's see if that worked. It worked! It's a miracle. I didn't even turn the TV on. That's how that's how magical this world that we live in is. Okay, let's go back. Let's get back into like the game that we're actually playing. You know, Brick Rigs. You probably heard of it. It's pretty sweet. I think that what we need to do to put this vehicle to its true potential is get another vehicle for it to blow up. Let's get out of this thing and let's spawn another vehicle. Wait a second. Don't you dare leave me. Don't you leave me. Do you see this? Do you see this? What the heck? Get back in. Drive it. Thank you. 
Okay, wait, 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 wait. Wait! Are you kidding me? This is unbelievable. Look at that! You can change... Okay, can we t can we move the... Oh man, look at this, wait. Look at that! That is too cool. This is amazing! Wow! Okay, let's put this thing in park, and let's spawn another vehicle and destroy it with the tank, because that's what you do with tanks. You destroy vehicles. And since we love the Sky Crane so much, it has been so good to us. See what happens when I try to spawn the, the Sky Train? Game blows up. <laughs> Sky Crane, why do you do me dirty like that? Why you gotta treat me this way? All right, guys, we are back in action. We got our tank back. The stinking helicopter blew up the game and made the Steam Workshop stuff not work anymore. So I had to figure out how to get it working again, but I was able to get it working again, so we're back in game. Of course, what we wanted to do before the game exploded on us uh, is uh, blow something up. So I think we'll just blow up this fire engine. That seems like a cool thing to to kill with a, with a tank. So let's just move him over here and uh, make sure to put him in park, put on the parking brake, beautiful. And then let's get our tank lined up. Oh, it's gonna be so good. It's gonna be amazing. This is what tanks are meant to be. All right, line it up. Boom, oh my God, that thing has some serious firepower. Holy cow. I did not expect it to like bat around a giant fire truck like that. That is, that is awesome. This tank is amazing. So the tank is awesome. Not gonna lie, it's it's unbelievable how awesome it is. But tank versus blender, I gotta put my money on the blender. I gotta put my money on the blender. So let's do this. Let's see who will who will prevail. <laughs> okay, he's he's doing all right. Tank's doing. Oh no, no, no. I I think the blender wins. Oh yeah. Blender wins. I will miss you, Tank. Let's check out another creation. All right, guys, on to the next creation. One that I could not resist. It looks so stinking awesome when I saw it in the Steam Workshop. This one's created by Magnum Farce, and yes, it is the Batmobile. It is so stinking cool looking. And uh, I hope it's fast. So I kind of want to try. Oh, I got my emergency brake on. That was stupid. Okay, I want a nice straightaway here. So let's. Let's go to the end of the street and see how fast... Oh, that's a jump. That's a jump. Okay, that's gonna be really awesome. And kind of terrifying when we hit it. Well, I'm, I've managed to... Austin Powers myself here. <laughs> I can't... There we go. It was only like a 12 point turn. But we managed. Okay, let's see how fast this thing goes. This is gonna be so cool. Oh no, we left some pieces on the train tracks. Hit that jump. Yeah! Stay, stay, keep it together! No! Too much responsibility for me, clearly. Well, gee golly willikers, Batman! Watch out for that curb! Yeah, I'm stuck on a curb again. Alright, curb, bring it on. Bring it on, curb! Bring it! Really? It's, it's well known that Batman can't fly. But let's see if the Batmobile can. It can't. The Batmobile can't fly. Oh no. We're trapped. There's curbs. We can't do it, you guys. The curbs are too powerful. Oh, we actually got over a curb. Okay, let's just take this thing. Let's take it all the way. What is this? Is this a hole? Oh no. The, what? That curb was literally like a wall. Before we say goodbye to the Batmobile, of course, we need to drop it into the inaugural going away of, of vehicles. Into the, into the blender. Even the Batmobile can't resist the allure of being thrown into the blender. Come on, Batmobile, you're killing me here. We're just gonna, we're gonna give it a little nudge here. Just a little nudge. Maybe another little nudge. There you go. See, see, was that so hard? Was that so hard, Batman? Where'd it go? Oh my God. Oh, it's going into the, <laughs> the blender up there. <laughs> oh. Oh, that was magnificent. What a way to go, Batman. You're always an overachiever. All right, we have time for one final creation, and it's a doozy. 
It's a giant crane. Now, this was created by the developer. He has a note on this thing that uh, you can't you can't normally build this. This is this is way bigger than what uh, what non-developers can build. So uh, don't expect. <laughs> It just fell apart. <laughs> what? Why did it fall apart? I wasn't even doing anything. But uh, but yeah, you won't be able to build something this big. Sorry, not right now at least. But look at how awesome this thing is. Now, I would love to pick up some stuff. Oh no! It's kind of, it's a little wobbly. It's a little wobbly. I don't know if it's because of where it spawned. Maybe we should try a different spawn. Let's, let's move. Oh, this is so cool. Okay. Now, please don't like fall apart. I just want to figure out how to actually use. Okay, that that's how you you turn. How do I switch? Oh, look at that. I'm lowering the crane very, very slowly. We've got to pick something up. Please don't, please don't fall. If I, if I leave this thing, I can't get back into it. We got to plan this out a little bit better. So I need to get rid of this. Go away. Sorry, Crane. Nothing personal. You're awesome. By all rights, you're amazing. You're a big, beautiful machine. But we need to spawn a vehicle first. All right, so I've spawned this F1 racer, which was made by Machine Gun Luke. And uh, I didn't actually play around with it much, but, uh, you know, it looks like a little F1 Lego. It's pretty cool. Um, I'm going to put it over here. And hopefully, we can pick it up. That would be pretty cool. Let's uh, let's just kind of get ourselves situated here, and then we'll lower the crane. It'll only take about 45 minutes, so I'll see you guys then. I can't seem to line it up, so I might have to jump out and try to hook it. But I don't know if it'll actually work. I don't know if the if you need like something to hook onto. Engage hook. Oh, it's hooked. But now I can't get back into the crane, can I? Like, can I? Eh, eh. No, I can't get back into the crane. I'm driving with the hook stuck to me. Let's see what happens when I drive off the cliff. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Just, just, just go off. <laughs> well, at least we hooked it to something. We couldn't get back into it, though. I don't, I don't know how to get back into it. Uh, maybe I'll have to figure that out at a later time, but man this thing is awesome And one last thing I wanted to show you guys since in the last episode. I built my derp house Yes, I built a brand new house. It's way way better. I'm just kidding. I didn't make this I there's no way that I have the talent or the skills required to make this kind of house this this thing was made by a guy named bat duck and uh, Wow um, after after seeing what I made uh, this is this is amazing. So well done, Bat Duck Man. But anyways, guys, that's gonna do it for this episode of Brick Rigs. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Again, if you have any creations that you've made that you'd like me to show off, um, be sure to let me know in the comments below. And of course, if you enjoyed this, be sure to hit that like button. But otherwise, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.